guys, this is Jackie, your nerdy crafter. And sometimes villains don't get enough love. For this week's tutorial, I am working with the super talented and really sweet Alexa. And so for this week's tutorial, Alexa and I decided to work on something villain and Mario themed. And so you guys will learn how to make your very own poison Harada plant necklace. I absolutely love this necklace and I love the swirls on the green. It is actually sturdier than you would think. If you look closely, you'll see that the purple is actually really shimmery because I used Perlex powders. This necklace is made even more awesome with Alexa's Bowser cosplay. She looks absolutely devious. I love her makeup, I love her outfit. She really did portray Bowser perfectly. Even the horns on the wig look absolutely phenomenal. Make sure you check out her video and her channel and subscribe while you're there. You will not be disappointed. She does so many amazing cosplays and makeup tutorials and just cute things in general. For those of you new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. There are plenty of geeky tutorials to keep you entertained. Equally, if you like this project, don't forget to leave a like and share. Here's what you'll need for this project. Green, purple, and white polymer clay. If you want to make it shimmery, you're going to need purple and green Perlex powders. A chain, rounded and pointy tools, a cutter, two jump rings, liquid sculpey, rubbing alcohol, and a q-tip to clean up your piece from fingerprints or dust particles. For the prana plant, make a circle with your purple, dust your purple perlex powder on top. Now put it in the freezer for 10 minutes. Cut out the mouth, put some black clay on the inside, place triangles for the teeth on the inside, put the white mouth by making snakes that have two pointy ends, And then take your white again and make the white dots right on top. Now take your green clay and make two leaves out of it. Dust it with your green perlex. Take your green again and you're going to make long snakes out of it. Twirl the top. Make sure you put your eye pin before you twirl it. Place it behind the leaves. And now place the piranha head right on top of everything. Make sure you use liquid Sculpey to keep them all together. Now you're going to bake it for 20 minutes at 275 degrees Fahrenheit. Make sure that your oven was preheated. All done! Don't forget to check out Alexa's channel and her video and subscribe while you're there. You will definitely be hooked. The Mario and Princess Peach in her video will also be a video on my channel later on in December. If you have suggestions for future geeky tutorials, leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to add me on Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, and Instagram, especially Instagram. I'm also going to leave all of Alexa's links in the description box below. Until then, I will see you guys next week. <laughs> Your horn fell off. <laughs> <laughs>